objective truths, but then communicate to others how to get there. Hey girl. <laughs> She's trying to get some writing in. She's actually a really good writer. They're actually all really good writers. No. You're a good writer. You are. I have um, been working on another row. I try to do it just um, every morning. I'm trying to just work on one row. <laughs> That's my little stitch stopper. I know I'm calling it the wrong thing, but um, I'm just working on a row. I'm, I thought I was going to be making scarves. I just need something to kind of mindlessly put my hands to. But I thought I was going to be making scarves, and then I ended up changing my mind and decided to expand them and make reading blankets for the kids. So this one is Cameron's. Um, and here, this pink and purple orangey one is savannah's and kendall's is actually i'm trying to I'm debating whether or not i should go between his regular green or gray or do like a green and white i think that's probably what i'll do for his so anyway that's over here i've been working on that this morning once i make my way through that um row i'll just pop it back in my bag and wait for another morning Cameron's making his smoothie. I'm making mine. We have a beautiful air fryer and we have really enjoyed it. So I saw that they had the um, small blender and wanted to try it. And this amazing glow protein. Very good. So, straw. So, I looked for a long time until I find one that I felt like was decently priced, which I still feel like this was out of pocket as far as pricing is concerned, but it's going to be fun. Um, we'll use the different sizes for the solar system, and then I also got two additional, like, large ones to do, uh, to try to do, like, a layers of the earth. I'm going to take these out and... Uh, label them, assign them to a certain um, planet. These are the big ones that I got. Hopefully it's kind of easy to cut through them and try to paint them and do like a layers of the earth situation. I got a set of brushes. This pretend play costume from quite a while ago. Originally for Cameron and now it only fits Savannah. So That'll work. Do one of our Friday night lives where we set up a presentation, invite the grandparents, that type of thing. So we'll see how that goes. And then with that goes this um, astronaut helmet that I'm very excited to use again. And then this is my little basket full of acrylic paints. Hopefully this will do the job. I do have um, some that are like glitter paint. So hopefully that looks really nice and could make some of our planets look really nice and shiny and fun. I do have these bigger acrylic paint that are fluorescent. Does that mean they glow in the dark? I just kind of gather all the supplies, tell them the basic plan, and let them go for it. So, good morning, Red Bird. Over here is my stack of books. I um, shopped off of our shelves. Um, usually, like, at least one person has read um, and we can like rotate around and 
get the other two to read or we'll see how it goes just kind of pulling information from different places so i have reaching for the moon the autobiography of nasa mathematician katherine johnson i think kendall read this one if i'm not mistaken Astrophysics for Young People in a Hurry by Neil deGrasse Tyson. We are also going to be doing um, uh, some of his master classes. Uh, I have the master class subscription and he has one of the courses. So we're going to go through that. It's kind of on scientific thinking and communication, I believe. So we're going to be going through that and then also reading through this. Um... An oldie but goodie, the no, the no nonsense guide to space, awesomely fun guide to the universe. I've got the school of numbers, which is basically just a math. I love saying maths because every time um, I do research on maths, they always let you know that the appropriate way to say it is maths with an S on the end. So that's how I try to say it. So, uh, the School of Numbers, we'll work our way through some more of this. Um, this one's just a fun, like, um, um, pop-up-ish kind of book. It's not really a pop-up book, but I can't think of the way to explain it. The Sky is Above My Eyes. Then we have uh, When We Walked on the Moon. She Caught the Light. Uh, Wilhelmina Stevens Flemings, astronomer, and what we'll build. Y'all know I love using um, picture books. These are some of the books that I got off of our shelves. I'm just trying to use it up before we give them away to others eventually. Um, I'm gonna get myself some coffee this morning. I've been using this mug ever since we started, or I started thinking of the unit. It's pretty cool. up glittering the 
planets. The ones with the rings, of course. Thank you.